wrong with y'all doing nothing look i had a taste for some low country shrimp and grits but y'all know i had to do it my way so come on in here it's gonna go fast so roll with me i had some fresh shrimp i took the shells off i put some water and obey season in there i'm making some homemade shrimp stock we're gonna use that later i cubed up some salmon and i'm seasoning everything with veretta's kitchen this and that season of course you know we had to use obey you can't have seafood without obey come on with it then i use zatarain's black and season toss it up real good put it to the side now the star of the show is the roux equal parts butter equal parts flour i use veretta's kitchen season flour the link is in the bio stir and cook it on medium heat until it gets desired darkness that you would like do not burn it now i have some chicken stock i'm making my grits according to the package or however you would like i diced up some onions some garlic and some bacon i'm rendering down the bacon take the bacon up i have some andouille sausage i added that in the pan took that up and then i'm gonna add my vegetables back in there let that render down real good nice and soft and add my um and do a sausage right back in there now let's jump back to these grits now once your grits cook like they're supposed to add you some heavy whipping cream you see how that's nice and creamy add your butter and your cheese come on with it mix it up set it to the side now i went ahead and took that shrimp stock that i had i poured it in the mixture with the um onions and the andouille sausage i took some of my roux put it in there to get to its thickness i added some old bay season in there as well and let it cook now i battered half for my shrimp and um salmon and the other half i put in the air fryer for a more healthier option i'm giving y'all some options okay now they're ready y'all so what we going to do plate it up now you can plate it whichever way you want but this is just the way i played it. i went ahead and put some um grits down first got some of that good old country low country gravy baby put it down there and added my shrimp and my salmon on top then after that, you pour another nice heaping spoon of that good low country gravy, y'all. When I tell you, it smells absolutely amazing and it tasted even better. Take some of that bacon that you had, crumble it on top, and of course, you got to add some greenery, a little bit of parsley or green onion if you would like. Listen, flavor is my love language. I hope y'all enjoy. Talk to y'all later. Bye.